Welcome back to Green Hell. The full story. Okay, look, our campfire burned out. We've got more uh, ash and, and charcoal, but we don't need it. We don't need it because, look, um, I've got, there's an armor mold that needs to be baked, and this one, um, th look, this is done with the charcoal stuff. And we, so we've got that one mold. Look, let's grab some charcoal. I just need to take, um, like, I don't know how many I'm going to need. Let's take six of them and shove them inside of here, and hopefully that'll be plenty for us. In fact, maybe five will do it. I don't know. But whatever. Let's light this up quickly, quickly. Do it. Because I want this armor right away. Um, if I could just figure out how to press buttons properly. Here, it's dry leaf. And then, yeah. We'll get it. We'll get it. And then we've got to take care of a little bit of food needs. I think I need water. But fortunately, it's like rainy season right now. And so, we need to shove this armor mold in there. And that won't take all that long. Yeah, I don't even need as many um, charcoals as I put in there. And then I don't think I need the mud bricks either. Because, look, we've got, well, we've got two of those. And then, yeah, yeah, we'll harvest this up. That'll give me four, right? Two more will give you... I wasn't crazy. I wasn't crazy. We figured it out. I was very confused last night. But I got it figured. Everything, Everything's going to work out. Everybody just relax. We got it handled. And we're going to get um, a little bit of rope. And I don't need any more rope, really, but whatever. We're going to grab some anyway. And I'm just waiting for that armor mold. And then we're going to make another piece of armor. Um, in fact, yeah, see, that's already quarter done. So we can come over here, and we're going to grab this banana leaf. And we're going to craft it along with three of these guys. Like so. And two pieces of rope, like we did last night. Just the same recipe. And we craft up that armor. And now, we've got another piece of metal armor. Oh, we're almost done with that. And so, I don't even care now how much durability the bone armor has. We'll just drop it and put this on. How much does this have? 50%. Okay. So, it's getting better and better every time we make one. I like that so much. Oh, you know what? I'm also going to put some charcoal in this box. We'll stick this charcoal in here just so we have a little bit of a stockpile of it. And, oh, it's nice to have a storage crate. Now, we've got this scrap thing, the band of scraps and scraps, and then um, we're going to use that with the psychoteria to make a potion today and go on a crazy trip, so uh, let's just look around for a little bit here on this stuff um, what do I need to okay, we'll put a little bit of this in here like so, and some of this mushrooms in there and yeah, I'm not even bother fertilizing that one plant, because I'm now I'm curious, it's like that's my control group I want to see how well it will grow without ever putting any fertilizer in it. And it's almost ready for to, to sprout fruits. So this one, yeah, we'll put a little bit of stuff in here. It's up at 82%. How are you doing? 77 here. Let's give you a little bit more. So, And this is now almost there. Okay, let's not watch it. A watch plant never sprouts or something like that. I don't know. But this is almost ready. Oh, I'm so excited. We've got one more. We'll get that, and then we'll have the mold, and then we've got this one. Here, let's grab this. We'll bring it right over there. So we can be ready. We'll be ready. I just moved this last night. Whatever. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Okay, let's go and check our plant again. And does that fruit on it yet? No, it's not done yet. Crap. Or maybe it needs a little bit of fertilizer. I don't know. We're not going to give it any fertilizer, though. You can't have fertilizer plant. I'm sorry, but that's just not just not a thing that you get. Are you ready yet? No. But the cool thing with the rain is, I mean, everything. I have no problem with water. Let's, let's get our needs satisfied here. We got all this water that's just spilling out on the ground. We might as well drink it. I, I need to drink it. So, no, I don't anymore. I've, I've got everything I need. And we got bananas here going bad. Let's eat one before it goes bad. And then, uh, yeah, I, this is four days and one day. Yeah, let's eat some of that. How are we looking now? Great. All we need is to eat some of these nuts. And, bam, we are, like, full. But <laughs> the irony is we're going to end up doing that potion thing and it's going to fill us up. Uh, that's what it did in the last time I played story mode is like uh, it didn't matter what I started out with I ended up with like everything full maxed and 
so that it's nice. The dead drug is has great side effect to it, you know. So how's this going? How's it go? Oh, look, it's ready. Yes, let's harvest our mold. We'll finish our. Oh, I'm so excited about this. Let's harvest. Uh, not not harvest. Crap, crap, crap. Okay, we, we know. Okay, everybody, just relax for Pete's sake. Just just take it easy. Here, three of those. Two of these. You don't have to rush. I just I want to do the drug thingy, but. Uh, first, gotta have my armor. I gotta. I'm, we're not gonna need it for the drug trip, but it, I don't care. I just want to have it done. You know, this it was my goal. And here we got bone armor. We dropped that. And you know, it's like I don't know. Is this going to this bone armor? Is it just gonna vanish over time? It probably is. I don't care though, because now we got metal armor. Next thing is a metal spear. I want a metal spear bad. And the metal. Oh look, see, this grew without any fertilizer whatsoever. If it goes faster with the fertilizer, fine. But now we know all we have to do is plant the damn things and just leave and come back at a later time and it'll be fine. There'll be fruit. But I don't really need that fruit. I need to get rid of these leeches, though. And and we need to go start... Uh, no, 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 no. we got to look for them. There we go. Oh, my God. There's so many of them. And... Uh, there we are. All right. Well, we're clean of leeches. We're good to go oh i'm so happy you got this thing done and it's too bad i don't have anything else to forge in there but uh it's fine I, i'm glad i didn't put any more charcoal in it than we needed well i did but any more than i actually did put in there so all right here's the bowl that we're going to use to scoop stuff out of there and we're going to go on a crazy trip let's do it all right Jake, you can do it, buddy. Yeah, it's not like you're low on energy or anything right now. Just do it. And it's ignited. So, now all I have to do is insert the stuff and then we go crazy. Let's do it. So, we're actually advancing the story now, guys. We, of all the things from the time we've, I don't even know how far into it we are. We're like two weeks in. Two weeks in, and I haven't even tried to find my wife. <laughs> oh, it's a little kid. What are you doing here? Uh, hey, wait! Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh. Shh, shh, shh. Oh, I, I do like this. It's creepy. Oh, wonder, you know, I wonder if I can... What's happening? Ooh. I've never tried going the opposite direction. What's happening? Or is it going to kill us or something? I can't pull out a weapon. Oh, it's creepy. Look at how misty. I can't see any. Oh, no, no. We, oh, it's getting so foggy in that direction. I, I can't see anything. I wonder if we could just wander the map like this forever. Wouldn't that be weird, though? I mean, we're... Okay, okay. I'm, I'm not advancing the story, clearly. But look how... Oh, oh, it's not letting me go any further. Oh, I can't go any further. It's just it's blocking me. The... the fog is so thick that I can't even walk through it. Okay, I get it. I get it. You want me to go this way? Stop that wind and weird kind of ominous music sound. Yeah, I guess if you don't follow your vision quest, <laughs> things start to go sour. Yes, yes, I don't speak your language. But we're, we'll follow you, little kid. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Lighting. Change. Look how it. Like, as soon as I get off the path, it's. I see, I've been wanting to do this last time. I didn't. I can't jump. I can't pull out a weapon. If we go. <laughs> Sorry, guys, if this is bothering you. 
that I'm not following the little kid? Well, that's just, that's what you do if you want to, like, follow the developer's game plan. But if you want to be a rebel, you go out here like this and run into solid walls of fog. Okay, okay, okay. I can't handle that, that noise any longer. Alright, let's get back on track. We'll follow the little kid a little bit more. Okay, okay. Very relax. Ah, oh, with the bright colors. Well, now we know what happens if you de try and deviate. <laughs> Look at all the pretty butterflies. Yeah, yeah, he's telling me, hey, you're going the wrong way. Come back, come back over here. I wonder if there's snakes and stuff in this dream phase. It's so weird running around like this. I mean, I can't access my inventory, I can't pull out a weapon, I can't harvest anything, obviously. <laughs> that little kid, he's so weird. Yes. What is happening? Look how everything goes all weird and twisty. I'm not moving at all. I'm not, I'm just standing in one place. And look what's happening to the world around me. Okay, alright, alright. It's making me dizzy in real life. I can't take that. Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Alright, so we're going through. Hey, kid! Where are you? Yeah, where is he? Where. Where am I? Oh, uh, where are you? You just passed through a solid stone. Uh, structure and now see this is so pitch black in here now I'm just surrounded by trees and trunk tree trunks yeah I can't I can't run I can't squat like I'm trying to just use any and look there I can't harvest that I want it but I can't have it I can't even sprint I want to sprint but I can't I just have to meander see our feet see now I'm just I want to explore everything in these weird dream sequences and the, the you know spirit vision quest thingies you know whatever this is that doesn't look safe I'm just walking on the air what the hell is happening all right that's that's where he came from walking into the darkness. I can't go backwards. I can't. Oh my god. Let's, let's turn around. Okay. What now? Oh. What? Yeah? I'm holding tea. Oh, here. Hello? Do you remember how we got here? Mia? Where are you? Oh. I don't like that sound. It's a precursor to me being shot or stabbed. First contact is always difficult. They're extremely weary. I, I don't remember anything. You, you were calling to me. I ran out of the tent and... They have to be. Civilization is killing them. And we don't even realize it. Mia. Maybe it would have been better if I just died back then. <gasps> Mia, they're... Okay. Yeah, this is just a diorama that shows Mia. She dropped her flashlight. Here's her. Oh, 
Look, look. Ah! This is something I never got in the story mode before. Because I wanted to, like, just do the story thing. But I now I just want to check out all the stuff and I'm not anxious to finish anything. So, this is where our boat landed. You can't see my cursor, but we can see where the boat landed. Where the village is, I'm assuming that's where I just was. Or, I don't even know. This is a weird map. I can't... I can't make heads or tails of that map. Alright, but whatever. We we read it. Um, anything else to find around here? So there's need to find that little thing. Yeah, yeah. So these guys, these are wax representations. And this is a wax Mia. And yeah, they were um, a little, little bit suspicious of her. Just a little. <laughs> so, hi, Mia. Hey. Mia, I... Oh, she turns into butterflies or ash or something. When the American colonization began, the conquistadores brought their diseases here with them. Many tribes were wiped out, and the rest moved even deeper into the jungle. Chief Kuini went on and on about whole generations of his ancestors being decimated until they received a gift from the jungle. And me? <laughs> Naively, I assured them about our good intentions. Yeah, did you warn them about the road to ruin? And what it's paved with? Okay. Uh, today I've reached the village. So far I've had no success communicating with the Yabawaka. Lots of other information. So, if you want to read it, there. Pause and read it. Good. Done. Great. Oh, kids, look. These children, I, I've seen them before. I miss them, you know? I wish I could see them again. Yeah, they're having fun with the radio. Alright, well, we're not going to touch Mia yet, because we know she's just going to turn into a, a poof of ashes. So, we, we got to look around. And, how about you? That is a weird hat that guy's got. I like it, though. I don't want one like that. And maybe I'll get my hair cut this way, too. Yeah, this is a this is a fine haircut this guy's got. All right, all right, all right we're going to stare at their hair. Just want to see if there's any other little tidbits tucked in anywhere. Well, I can't really go anywhere. This is pretty constrained. But, you know, the great thing is, like, I don't have a haircut like these guys, but I am wearing the same outfit right now. So you guys can imagine that. If you wish or not, Mia. Just let me. You know, if we mix Mia in with mud, we could make mud bricks and build out of it. <laughs> they trusted us, embraced us as their own. They even, they even shared their secret with us. Don't speak foreign languages at me. I'm just an anthropologist. I'm not some kind of linguist. Okay, there's there's Stark. Stark over there. There's nothing in there. Hey girls, how you doing? There, I guess the girls don't get to dance. They just get to clap. They clap along while the guys do all the dancing. backpack. Can I get in there? No. A notebook. There. The Yawaka are finally starting to trust me. It's about time. I'm sick of sleeping at the... If you want to read this, I'll press the R there. Pause it. Read it. Okay. You done? Great. I'm more interested... Like, I want to see all the notes and stuff, but I don't necessarily want to spend all the time on video reading them. 
but I do want to check out. So she's having another conference with the village dude, and that's she's got the gift. They've given her the gift. And this guy, he's very suspicious. He doesn't think that they should be given the gift. And I think he's going to paint himself with bones or whatever and then come hunt me down. Because that's how they do. Um, okay, I'm not seeing any other little secrets over here. Maybe there's something over here. We gotta check it. Because I only get one shot at these dream drug trip things. But it's just it's very dark over in these little nooks and crannies. And I'm doubtful that I'm gonna find anything else over in this area. But, you know... If that is the case, it's not because I didn't try. Alright. Fairly well satisfied with that. How about you guys? You got secrets? You know, got a stick. Got a piece of bamboo. This guy, he's got lovely red hair. And these guys, yeah. They're up to no good, you can tell. What about these guys? Uh, they're just, they're disinterested. They're, they don't like the dancing. You guys, anybody burn their feet yet? That's it. They're really close to a very large bonfire. That's gotta be fairly hot. They, they shouldn't just stand in one place like that. They really need to turn around, you know, like heat up the other side. Alright, we're done here. Right, Mia? Right, Mia? I just wanna... gift. Okay, well, we know this isn't going to work. Watch. I'm going to reach for it and... Jake? Come in, please. Jake, just grab it. I need you. No. Mia? Mia? Wait, I'm here. You call it the worst times. Well, that's that. Mia just ruined everything. You know, dead wives sometimes can be awful. Hello? Jake? Please? I can't live without you. Well, you know that. Is it really you? What happened? Are you safe? Gracias a Dios que estás vivo. Me? I'm safe. Trust me. Tell me what happened to you. I was losing it trying to contact you. I was hoping you could tell me that. You called me in the middle of the night and I, I, I ran out to look for you and all I remember is running and falling? Wait, you fell? That doesn't sound good. Okay, okay um, take it easy. Breathe. Do you know where you are? Huh. I, I have no idea. Oh, come on, Jake. Can you give me some clue as to your whereabouts? A landmark or something? Um, we're in the village. Oh, the village. Recently I found a tribal village. It's deserted, though. I'm not sure why. Is it a large, round village? Yes. No, rather small. But it's large Just a few enough. huts. Cariño, if it's not the main village, it could be anywhere. We never found all the campsites. Hey, hey, there has to be another way. Found a map. It's half burnt, but there's a location marked on it. Uh, Lambda 2. Not sure what it is. Do you? No, I don't think so. Can you get there? Well, I will try. You... Help me. Mia? Come again? You're breaking up. Without the... Oh, hope. Mia? Mia? Oh, fuck. Battery's dead. Oh, no. Right. So, well, apparently we spent all night, or several nights, I don't even know. Look, all of our meat is dried, 
and it's six o'clock in the morning. So uh, we're going to call it now, and um, we'll pick it up from here next time. For now, thank you so much for joining. I hope you guys have enjoyed this. If you have, smash that like button, leave me any comments, tips, tricks, recommendations, or death threats. Look, see, I told you all my stats, or everything's full. Um, uh, subscribe, share, favorite, and if you haven't already played with your ding dong for today, do that. And if if you have, um, then play with my ding dong, and it'll be notified of, or you will be notified of new videos when they come out. And um, that that'll be nice for both of us. And I'll talk with all of you again very very soon.